So Garrett built his own six axis a six axis controller with Q block. Some stuff. It's kinda cool. Wow. Go left. Can you go left? Oh my god, this is awesome. So why do we need it in a you know, PS3 or whatever? Huh. Now I've got an accelerometer on here. It's actually a three axis controller. You can control the throttle and I've got eight buttons. We're using the Q block to handle the data acquisition for the axis or axi or whatever. And cool. a small circuit I designed with a USB microcontroller to actually handle the joystick um, joystick commands. Awesome. Wow. Six axis controller for the PC. Well, similar to it, but will you, will you have documentation soon? Yeah, I'm gonna okay. write this up. Alright, cool. Well, you can see it's kinda of fun. Go 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 all the way backwards. Can you do that? Uh like do a loop? Yeah, do a loop. Uh oh, oh whoa. Dang, that is tight. Now you have a you can build your own? How much does it cost to build one of these? Um well you can do this with the smallest Q block available. Yeah. Um you can also use like the hardware that I, I chose like a dollar and a half in quantity. So it's probably like twenty bucks plus the Q block to actually get this going. So like seventy bucks you can make one of these? Yeah. And you can wow. add way more axes. You can add dozens and dozens of button inputs if you want to. Uh hat switches this is cool. and all kinds of good stuff. What is this game? Uh it's just uh oh, is this free? It's a just a game demo. Oh. Our Heroes of the Pacific came out last year. Cool. So I'm not very good at you it. Just give me a copy of this game. Huh. So I can play it. <laughs> anyway, that was preview of the six axis controller for PC. Yippee!